Well, it's been a minute since I've been on, my friends. Um, I don't know if you have me on your Facebook or not, but I posted that I am down 17 pounds. Woohoo! So, I'm excited about that. Um, sorry I haven't been on for a little bit. My mom came into town, so basically I spent a lot of time. She was here like all last week, so um, we were on the go the whole entire time, plus I worked. So, with all of that, I'm back on track. Um, I didn't do so bad when mom was here. I weighed in this morning. I know I was supposed to weigh in yesterday, but I weighed in this morning and I gained while my mom was here 0. 0.6 pounds. That's it, just 0. 0.6. So I didn't have a loss, but I didn't really have a gain either, which is good. Um, I tried to really behave while she was here. We ate out a lot, so I really feel like that is part of the problem. That is what happened. Um, I had basically on the Sunday, my mom and I, I ate out Saturday night. I met a friend who flew in from California. She had some family things to take care of. I haven't seen this friend. Oh my gosh, I haven't seen her in years so it was a super super nice dinner we went to cheesecake factory um i got what did i have i had holy cow i don't even remember what i had but i tried to keep it on the low carb side oh grilled chicken that's what i had i had grilled chicken and then on Sunday morning, my mom and I met my nephew and his wife for breakfast, um, and we went to the pancake house. Well, there I did not behave too well because I actually had two eggs, one piece of bacon, but I also had two pancakes, and I had butter and syrup on those, so that was not so good, I guess, right? But... <laughs> For later lunch, we met my niece, who it was her 25th birthday. So we met my niece, we met her fiance, we had my brother, my sister-in-law, and my other niece and nephew, and my great niece was like all there, right? So we went to McAllister's and I got half a salad and half a sandwich. I got the club sandwich. Well, I didn't check my points before I went into McAllister's. Let me tell you, I really should have checked my points because it was like 25 points or something like that for the McAllister's and I'm like, what the heck? So obviously on Sunday, I used up the whole entire everything for the week, right? So that was kind of crazy. And then on Monday, we met some cousins um, for lunch and uh, my nephew's wife, um, we met her too, Taylor. So we had, I, it was just a really fun, fun weekend. I'm, I can't even tell you how fun it was. Um, worries and cares all went away. I mean, I enjoyed my mom being here so much. I didn't want her to leave. <laughs> so, um, I'm hoping that this week I can get down, I would like to lose at least two pounds this week. So I have been very, very much tracking. I've been weighing, I've been measuring. So hopefully I have some kind of loss by next Wednesday. And I've been weighing in on Wednesday. I think I might switch that up to Thursday because you know, my weekend is Sunday, Monday now. So that gives me a little bit of in between the my days off and then, you know, my way in. So that is what I'm gonna try to do, try to focus on, um, is getting that weighing in on Thursday versus weighing in on Wednesday. So hopefully um, I see some kind of, some kind of new loss, right? I have to tell you, I had on an outfit Monday that I had just got the shirt from Sheen and when I ordered it, I ordered the normal size. I really feel like I could have ordered a little bit smaller. Um, I posted the picture on Facebook, so I'm not sure if everybody saw 
the OOTD of the day for Monday, but um, I'll post it again. Let's see, I'll, I'll go ahead and put that picture in right here. Ready? Here it comes. to be able to feel good in what you have on, right? So um, I cannot, 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 can I just say this again? I cannot wait to get into the next size down. I cannot wait till everything is just so big and hanging on me. Um, and that is where I'm trying, that's my goal. That is my goal. So with stating that, we're, I'm gonna get it. I am doing it, girls gentlemen i'm doing it i'm getting this done you know what who said that it's hard to lose weight when you're in your 50s well it's not easy but it's hard to lose weight if you're in any age so 50s doesn't make a difference right and i have to tell you that 17 pounds down already makes me feel like i'm younger so i'm happy 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 um i am doing the chair um aerobic or chair yoga that's what it is chair yoga i am still doing that and let me tell you i really do feel like it's helping like my waist so like i'm getting that waist back again and that really excites me also <laughs> i'm ready for my curves back i don't want to be a bloop that's what i was a bloop so um i'm going to continue that as soon as the 30 days is up i am going to switch from the chair over to I think the wall so we'll see that might be a little <laughs> that might be a little stressful for me but you know what I'm willing to try it and willing to see what happens um so with work has been kind of busy for me um people are needing more hours people are needing help so I'm kind of working a little bit like this week I said I'm getting overtime so I'm loving it. I need all the overtime I can get because I'm telling you that move from Missouri to Florida, Florida to Missouri, it drained my account. All the deposits that I had to put down, all the deposits I had to change when I moved to this apartment. So I have to get regenerated and start moving forward again. The past is in the past, right? My goodness. Anyway, so... Um, I'm still feeling that a lot. And you know what? When you're in a financial situation, it really puts a toll on you. And that's, you know what I told y'all, I'm an emotional eater. So I'm a stressful eater. So I have to, um, I have to keep just moving and keeping that out of my brain. So this week might be tough this weekend it's you know father's day is coming up and hmm i'm not ready for that one so it'll be the first one <laughs> since my dad passed away so it's the first father's day so we're all gonna feel that um my friend she lost her dad this year so she's feeling that so it's it's complicated with the whole feelings and missing him and you know all of that so i am working on saturday um i work open to close on saturday so that'll keep me busy um i'm looking forward to my sunday monday trying to get things together i am going to try to get a couple of videos done this weekend so um i can get back on track because i was putting out three videos a week i'm so sorry i haven't been doing that i am trying to go i've been having technical difficulties at home i have spectrum and i don't know if i didn't have enough but I was getting to where like I did a video on Friday and it's it wouldn't let me put it out so it just would not ever like upload onto YouTube so hopefully I can get that uploaded and uh, I don't know maybe use it this Friday <laughs> we'll see I mean it was like a whole long thing I was like pouring out my heart and soul right so um, if I can get that going I did call spectrum and I 
well, I didn't call them, I went online, and I upped up my, whatever you call it, the speed, I guess it is. So I went from 300 megabyte pixels. I don't, I am not technical. I have no idea. But anyway, I upped it. So hopefully they just sent me, I got new equipment yesterday. I am going to look at that. I need to switch out my equipment, I guess, so that I get more faster um, coverage. So hopefully when I upload this video, it goes like that instead of taking. Each video was taking me up to an hour or more for it to get off of the software that I use um, to edit onto YouTube. So, and now it's just, it's like not. So like I have this whole 20 minute video that I can't use. So it's getting harder and harder for me. So hopefully this solves the problem um, because by the time you edit and by that you got like two, three, four hours into it, you know? So anyway, um, I am doing the video today. Hopefully I can get this out today. If not, I will try to get this out tomorrow before I go to work. So I get off at seven tonight. So hopefully tonight when I come home, I can put it together and put it up. I miss you guys. I so miss you guys. It's like, you know, I always like, I love being able to come home, open up and just chatting with you guys in the comments. It's wonderful. And I appreciate all of you so, so much. Um, it helps me. It helps me stay on track. It helps me to know I have you guys in my corner rooting for me too, you know? Um, my emotions have been really high lately. I have had some situations like take place. Things are happening. Like I said, financially, I'm kind of struggling. Um, relationship wise has been a big struggle until I've just decided, you know, <laughs> it is what it is, right? Um, you can't make somebody want to be with you. You can't make somebody love you. So it's finally sinking into the skull. <laughs> finally, right? Um, so Florida is not the place for me. That's all I'm saying. It's not going to be the place for me. I probably will never live in Florida again. Um, and I'm just putting it out there. And uh, what happens, happens, you know? Anyway, so... I need to be getting to work. It is getting close to that time. I just wanted to say hello to everybody. I wanted to also mention that I am down on 17. Cannot wait to say I'm down on the 20. Um, and this week I am trying to lose at least a couple of more pounds. So if I could get three down, of course, I'm gonna be down my 20, right? We're three pounds away from my 20 mark. Woo! three pounds I cannot wait I cannot wait um my mom's like I can tell in your face your face looks so much smaller it looks and she's like you're looking great I'm like thanks mom so uh, hopefully by the end of or hopefully by next weigh-in I am getting even closer you know so three pounds would be wonderful if I could lose those this week I'm not feeling so great either. My tummy is not feeling good right now either. So that makes a big difference too. But I am doing breakfast, whether I want it or not. I am eating lunch and I'm coming home from lunch. Isn't that wonderful? I can actually come home for lunch. So that is a huge difference too, because when I come home, I can have a fresh salad. I can have something hot. I can have whatever the case may be. Little Buddy is loving that I am coming home for lunch because, you know, he gets to go out and go potty. He gets mommy to be around. So he's a good boy. And he's liking it too. Come here, buddy. Come here. You want to see buddy? I love my buddy. Here, come here. Let's say hi to everybody. Say hi. Look, right here. Look up here. Look up there. Say hi. <laughs> so... Buddy's loving life with mom being around more. He's actually a little bit more happier. Buddy's getting very full. I'm losing weight. My buddy is gaining weight. 
I don't know what to do about that. He got neutered and when he got neutered, he gained a ton of weight. He's not eating any more than what he used to eat. So I don't know, I gotta get him to the vet and see what's going on. I'm not walking very much with him either. He gets to go walk, but not like for a long walk. So maybe that's something I need to get going with him also. It's going to help him and it's going to help me, right? All right, everyone. I am going to go. I will talk to you guys coming up soon. <laughs> talk to you later. Bye. Mwah.